morning, good afternoon, good night, whenever you just so happen to stumble upon this video. As always, we have to get the church announcements out of the way. My legitimate work at home job blog was just updated with some really good work at home job opportunities that you guys should go over and check out if you are in search of a legitimate work at home job. Link down in the description box. Okay, on to the topic at hand. I am going to be doing an updated Q&A video in regards to work at home. I get so many messages that they're a little bit overwhelming, so I'm not always able to respond back to each and every message as I would want to. So I am making this video because I want whoever has any types of questions in regards to work at home, I want you to put those questions down in the comment section down below. Whatever question that you have in regards to work at home, put it down in the comment section. I have been working from home since about 2011, 2012-ish. So I know my stuff, so to speak, when it comes to the work at home job world, okay? So whatever question that you have, if you want to know what type of equipment that you need, if you want to know, um, do they take out taxes? Do they not take out taxes? Any question that you have in regards to work at home, leave it down in the comment section down below. Now, I'm not going to leave you guys with that, okay? I have to tell you guys, there are so many of you that sell yourselves short when it comes to work at home. And what I mean by that is, you'll look at a job description and you'll see something like, um, must have six years of customer service experience or uh, associate's degree preferred or bachelor's degree preferred, whatever, what have you. And oftentimes you guys will look at those um, requirements and you'll be like, you know what, I'm not even going to worry about applying because number one, I've applied to a ton of work at home jobs. Nobody has ever contacted me back, so I'm not going to waste my time. Let me tell you, the very time that you decide to not apply for that work at home job, guess what's going to happen? That is the one time that the company will likely reply to your application. There are thousands of people who are applying for these work at home jobs and that is not to discourage you. My thing is, I myself had been applying to these work at home jobs for years, okay? Literally for years. The one time that I decided that I was just gonna randomly get on one of those job boards and look around for some work at home jobs, that was the day. This was, and I was at work at a brick and mortar, mortar job where I was working outside of the home at that time. I was actually just had a little bit of downtime at work, got on the computer, and I said, you know what? I, I literally, I checked that job board on a daily basis to see if there was anything on there that um, would pick my interest or something that would just, you know, make me be lucky, okay? Maybe I was gonna look up that particular day. And that particular day that I got on there, when I had some downtime at work, I logged on. It was a lady who was saying that she had a, um, a position that was available with Fancy Hands because this was the time that they had what they called mentors. And if you couldn't get into Fancy Hands on your own, you could come in as what they call a cohort where you basically sign in under a mentor and basically for every task that you do. So say for instance, I did a task that was worth $2. My mentor might have got like 50 cent of my $2 or something. And that's because they signed you up as a cohort because you couldn't get in on your own. Because a lot of times people will say that they apply for Fancy Hands and their application gets denied. Um, you could actually sign up under a mentor and you're automatically in, okay? And I think you are able, when you're a mentor, I think you're able to bring in, I don't know, maybe five, 10 people, I'm not a thousand percent sure. But that's actually how I got into Fancy Hands by logging onto one of those job boards, workplacelikehome.com. I missed that place. Somebody told me that there's another um, job board, something similar to Workplace Like Home, or maybe the people that were running Workplace Like Home has opened another job board. I'm not a thousand percent sure, but I have to find it, okay? But again, if you are looking for a legitimate work at home job, there are a ton of places that are currently hiring right now, right now. Link is down in the description box down below. Also, if you are um, if you have any questions as it regards to work at home, leave those in the comment section. I will be making a video probably in about a week or two. I'm going to give people time to comment on the um, this particular video so that I can gather all of the questions and answer them. Okay, of course, if there are multiple questions that are one and the same. I'm not going to answer those questions multiple times. So if I see your see a question that you've asked that somebody else asked previously to you, I'm going to answer that question one time. I hope that makes sense to you guys. 
Also, I have a legitimate work at home job channel that I am going to be utilizing in the very, very near future. So if you guys are interested in that, head on over there and subscribe because a lot of these videos will be going over there. As a matter of fact, I am going to upload this video over there as well. So anytime you see a work at home job video here, you will see it over there as well. But I want you guys to keep in mind, eventually the videos are going to venture over there on that page, okay? I've had that page for a couple of years um, and I want to make sure that I'm utilizing it because it's just sitting there stagnant. So that link will also be down in the description box down below. Good luck and happy job hunting and I will see you in the next video. Bye.